have felt the whisper of a word. Give me your map and I will show you where its echo can be found. Hey, how's it going and welcome back. So today is World War time. We've popped up to Heith Rothgar, had a little chat with Angier, and he's given us a nice little location called Lost Valley Redoubt. This is where we can pick up the second Become Ethereal shout. It's full of Forsworn. Uh, there is two Hargravens to deal with. There's a hidden chest and there's also a little hidden way of getting an extra point in speech and that's a real little doozy and that's really really hard to find if you don't know how to do it so anyway onwards and upwards let's crack on and as usual i'm not going to be particularly subtle about this i'm going to use the boys and janissa as my muscle uh, I'm probably going to be concentrating more on showing you where the chests and bits and bobs are. One thing you've got to remember though, is every time you go through one of these little entrances up here, there's going to be a trap. And some of them actually are quite effective, especially the mammoth head one. Uh, you'll see that later on. And my usual caveat, uh, this will be done according to your build. Um, so I don't think many of you will be able to do it this way, some will obviously. Stealth's a lot of fun, but be bear, do bear in mind, at the end, you will not be able to do that in a sneaky way. So uh, I'll explain more at the end of the video. And there's the first trap I was talking about. And uh, I think Janice had survived that, if she has. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> and there's another one. Oh. Like I say, I'm letting the uh, Janice and the boys do everything, all the, all the hard work. Now the first chest I want to show you are down here. Yeah, don't underestimate the Forsworn. I keep on calling them Forsaken for some weird reason, but the Forsworn, anyway, they are tough little cookies. And they do level up with you. Okay, the first chest. There's a lot of decent loot uh, around here. Um, lots of ingredients and stuff like that. So do take your time and, and uh, pick them up. And there's a chest in here. And Bosch. That's not bad at all. Not bad at all. Okay. And a third chest on this level. These potions could become handy actually uh, later on. So do, do pick them up. And another trap there. That one could possibly kill you if you're a lower level. I don't want to kill the goat. <laughs> okay. 
Briar Heart. The, these guys are tough. Oh, he's hitting me hard. I've got one new controller, and I'm not exactly. That's smooth. I better run away. Run away. Run away. Okay. Let the guys deal with them. Will I heal? As I said, this place is absolutely swarming with them. I hope Mr. Goat's all right. Oh, he's killed my uh, killed one of the boys. You're gonna pay for that. Oh, stop moving, you little. Come here. One more shot should do. Someone's taking pot shots at me now as well. That's it. Well, who's doing that? Where are you? There you are. Got him. Oh, miss. I think Genesis Atronax got him. Or at least keeping him busy anyway. So. Okay, Brian Hart. Do on that and the Hiscarp. Lovely. Ebony Dagger. Lovely. As usual, I'm not spending that much time um, hunting around for loot. There is stuff uh, hidden around uh, worth picking up. Okay. That's this level done. Got the feeling I have missed something down here, but hey, doesn't matter. Onwards and upwards. Now there's a little hidden chest uh, I'll show you. Uh, not this one, here's one here. This one's obviously not hidden. Black Soul Gem, brilliant. Okay, so if you come round up here, it's not a great loot chest, but hey, you know. Job done. There you go. I've done this a few times on, on a low level and it's, um, it's pretty difficult, to be fair. Soul Jim, nom nom, nom 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 nom. So this is where you're going to come up to the uh, word wall. Just cross over the river here on a little bridge. Now what you're going to do is you can come up against two Hargravens and they're resurrecting a Briarheart. You have to kill the Hargravens quickly, uh, especially if you're at a lower level. If you don't kill them quickly, they'll resurrect the Briarheart and they're pretty tough. So bang them out. And she's down. Yeah, just to make sure. And that's it. And that's the second one will become ethereal. A great shout. There's a decent a bit of loot around here. Um, look on the ground as well for bits and bobs. And you've got the uh, Brian Hart Geiss. Um, I'll do like a little mini video on that uh, later on.
And there's lots of ingredients on the floor, as I mentioned before, so do pick them up. Glass arrows, that's good. Bring of the night. Oh, that's not bad. Okay. That's not bad. Some good, good ingredients. Oh, I can't get a hitbox there. Come on. Come on, where are you? Okay, well, the human heart. Come on, come on, human heart. I want that. Yeah, not too bad. Okay, once you're done there, oh, another bright heart, lovely. Like I said, do have a little look around. Once you're done, I suggest you quick save. We're going to go on to another quick location here. So run down along the bridge and take a left. And we'll head up towards the tower. If you go to the right here, there'll be another little chest on the left. Again, there's not a massive amount of loot in it, but, you know. Okay, so we've got another Hargraven to deal with up here, so be prepared. Got it. Oh, Jenna's to get out of the way. Oh well. <laughs> Good job. Okay. There's a few little bits and bobs here in the tower. Nothing actually to write home about, except one little skill book. And there she be, alteration. Hail Sithis. Okay, now there's always a dwarven great sword in the stone there. If you hit that trap, that thing will fry you. The trap at the uh, top of the stairs there. A little money bag in the corner. Yum yum. Nice fumble fingers. Yeah, that trap there. If a uh, pressure plate. And yum yum. And there's a chest at the bottom here. Yeah, okay, dwarven helmets worth a bit, take that. Got the carry weight, ebony dagger, yum yum. And to the left at the bottom, there's a chest. All these chests seem to be levelled and random. But you get an indication of the kind of thing you're going to get in it. And very little. But every little bit. Okay. Now this is where we get the extra points in speech. I only discovered this myself uh, not very long ago. So what we do, run across the bridge. Have your ethereal shouts um, ready. Make sure they're all done. Oh, that one needs a uh, a dragon soul spending. Okay. 
Have it hotkeyed. Just run towards the end. Do your shouts. And jump. Bosh. And when you come out here, you're going to see this guy. He's going to give you a little bit of dialogue. You can't interact with him for some weird reason. But just let him talk. And just stand around like a chump till it actually happens. There you go, Spreach increase to 91, or one more than you had. So I think I'll be calling it a day on this video. Uh, I really do hope you enjoyed this and you found it useful. And if you did, please leave a like, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys later.